Anne Heche's estate is being sued by the woman whose home was destroyed in the actress's fatal crash back in August. According to documents obtained by People, attorneys for Lynn Michelle filed documents in the Superior Court of California in Los Angeles County on November 9th, requesting at least $2 million in damages for negligence, infliction of emotional distress, and trespass. Per the filing, Michelle, who was renting the home at the time of the crash on August 5th, states that she was working from home when she was stunned by the dramatic force of Haitia's vehicle slamming through the front wall and driving through the living room, kitchen, home office, and primary room closet before settling into the laundry and storage room of her house. The documents add that the incident has left Michelle terrified, severely traumatized, and without a place to live. According to earlier reporting by People, the Los Angeles Fire Department said that the accident caused structural compromise and heavy fire to the one-story home. One day after the crash, the homeowners launched a GoFundMe to help cover the loss of Michelle's belongings. There, they called her a kind and generous person. According to the GoFundMe, 59 firefighters took over an hour to extinguish the flames that were caused by the crash, an account that was repeated in Michelle's illegal filing. After Haish crashed into the home, the actress was hospitalized, then intubated. She never regained consciousness. Her death has been since ruled an accident. After news broke of Haish's passing, Michelle expressed condolences in an Instagram video directed at Haisha's loved ones, especially her children. My heart goes out for them. She added, this entire situation is tragic and there really are just no words.